all right guys we're going to start this recipe by making our dough and we're going to do a two ingredient dough it's a weight watchers well it's a recipe i found on the weight watchers um, page and you're going to i'm going to use a quarter cup of flour and a quarter cup of plain non-fat greek yogurt And this dough recipe is three points by itself. So we're just gonna add the yogurt to the flour. And you know, we just mix it together until it forms a ball of dough. Okay, so now it is formed into our just our ball of dough. And now I am going to get some parchment paper so that I can flatten it out into like a thin pizza crust. And I always like to flatten it out some with my hand and then I will use my um, roller to roll it out some more. And you can roll it out as thick or as thin as you like your pizza crust to be. Once I get this flat as I want it, I'm just gonna put it in the oven for about four to five minutes on 400 degrees and see it's kind of sticking to my my um, parchment paper because I did not spray it first but there you go that's as thin as I'm gonna get it so I will be back and we'll do the, the sauce that I'm gonna make okay so my crust is ba has baked and I got it texture I want it so now I'm going to make the sauce. I'm using some green yogurt and I'm going to use one, excuse me, one laughing cow wedge. I'm also going to use some Old Bay seasoning, but I pulled out the blackened and I actually just want to use the regular Old Bay seasoning. So I'm going to use a little minced garlic with that as well. And I'm gonna put it all into a bowl and combine it together. I'm gonna get about a tablespoon of the Greek yogurt. And there you see I have about a tablespoon and I'm just gonna use one of the Laughing Cow uh, wedges. And I'm just going to use that as my base 
for my pizza instead of like if you would do a tomato sauce on a normal pizza. Measure the obey, I'm just going to sprinkle some in. I'm just going to combine it flat to get my uh, laughing cow wedge to kind of mix in with the yogurt and the seasonings and just to make it into like a creamy spread. Put it on our crust and then spread it all over our crust. And the spread that I'm putting on here with the Greek yogurt and the Laughing Cow Wedge, that's just one point. The lapping cow wedge is the only points in that. Greek yogurt is zero. And of course the garlic is zero and the seasoning is zero. So now I have some salmon that I grilled a couple days ago. And I'm just going to use that in the pizza. taste of the pizza I just did a little um, lemon and some obey and I'm just taking took the skin off of it and I'm just breaking down the salmon into smaller pieces so I can put it all over the pizza up some so now we're just going to put it all over on the crust and you can use as much or as little of it as you would like but if you don't add any oils or anything butter or anything to your salmon when you cook it it is zero points
right, so now I'm gonna chop up some spinach to add to the pizza. some mozzarella cheese and I'm just going to add one ounce of cheese to it and the mozzarella cheese I use is a Trader Joe's light mozzarella cheese and it's one point I'm gonna put it in the oven and I will be back to show you how it turns out. Alright guys, here's the finished product. I baked it at 375 for about 14 to 15 minutes and there you go. It turned out perfect. This pizza is so good guys. You definitely should try it. If you do end up trying it, please come back and let me know how you liked it. So I hope you like this video guys and I'll talk to you again soon. Bye.